Good morning, I'm Helen Prospero. On today's show, first day, we're talking showbiz. Dan Watson's here with his Friday five this week. Well, at number five, I am not happy at all about this, Helen. By all accounts, or at least it's on the show. I mean, he has, <laughs> of course. So I just wonder how the show, but it's going to be very interesting. At number four. Well, this has cheered me up, actually, number four. Kate Middleton made her first solo. It really does, it really does. OK, that was number four. I was getting confused there. Number four, wasn't it? What's in at number three? Number three, Britney Spears made her first English appearance in the circus tour. She sings a lot. Lo well, obviously, we're all talking about it. Who is it? Who, who is it? <laughs> of course, of course. Yeah, she's captured the imagination mm. of the public. Hash. She is so good for, ra for rating. Oh, we'll she's see. the bookie's favourite. Russ. X Factor is your number one this week. Well, it is number Number one, and it's number relations between Talisa and Kelly Rowland. Are when Kelly came up to the judges' desk for the first. Hopefully this week. Well, this is, uh, Dan, as always, uh, <laughs> lovely to see you. Thank you. From Rio to Los Angeles now, where Ross King continues his series, looking at some of Hollywood's most incredible homes. This week, he's travelled south of LA to a house garage, maybe a million dollars. Who knows? Hey, don't forget that property is for sale if you've got seven million dollars to spare. Now then, after the break, Michael Jackson evidence overnight about the singer's use of pain. Killers. Entertainment reporter Jill Simonian's uh, there for us. Uh, morning to you, Jill. What's the latest? Stuff. How much longer is the trial uh, going to last? Oh, that's every dad's fear, isn't it? Shows professional to the end, just like you, Jill. <laughs> well, fashion news now. And if you've ever wanted to smell like you're from Essex, whatever that smells like, or wishy look. Welcome back. Now she's the girl who seems to have it all. A billionaire for a father and a lifestyle that most of us can only dream of. People do view you at the moment. Oh. That does look pretty spoilt, I would imagine, to most people. The yacht we see of his wealth, I mean, you have been able to have the most astonishing fashion, don't you? I love my fashion. My mum was a model, and I always used to look up to her getting dressed up. Are there any downsides, Tamara, to being...